press the bell icon on the YouTube app and never miss another update. Turning now to India, Anka, which is making some big changes to its tax system. That's right. So it's India's biggest tax reform since independence, and it's set to take effect on July 1st, making the country for the first time a true single market. Before this, taxes were levied by each of the Federation's 12 states. But now, a single tax authority will be responsible for the equivalent of 1.7 trillion euros. The goal here is to unify the Indian economy, but the transition is likely to be turbulent. France 24's correspondents in New Delhi have this special report. It's past midnight. These trucks are waiting to clear the final check post before they can enter the capital, New Delhi. I've been stopped 17 times between Mumbai and Delhi, and I've spent 270 euros. These drivers had to pay a separate tax each time they crossed into a new state before arriving in New Delhi. For them, the introduction of a single tax system is the end of a logistical nightmare. If there is one tax for the whole country, for all states, whether large or small, then everyone will benefit. The GST is the only way for our country to move forward. There is no alternative. The tax reform is finally here, after 17 years of lengthy negotiations between New Delhi and the 29 states in the Union. The transition is likely to be rocky. Praveen Khandelwal is the head of the Traders' Union. He is acting as a bridge between unhappy traders and the government. Uh, there is some section of people, those who are a little unhappy with the tax rates, and uh, government must take cognizance of the issues raised by them. Small businesses could end up paying more, and everyone will have to declare their income online. Surprisingly, some companies may have to file 1,400 tax returns each year instead of just two. But this economist believes the reform is absolutely necessary. Multinationals which would come in, uh, they want that kind of a platform, so their ease of doing business is assured. Over a period of time, as things get adjusted in two, three years' time, maybe things might uh, ease a little. In a country where only 3% people pay income tax, the government also hopes the reform will expand the taxpayer base. Moving on.